Hello, in this video I guide you how to authenticate Wi-Fi by username and password. So I am going to guide setting up free radius on Raspberry Pi and then connecting it to my wireless router. First, install an operating system for Raspberry Pi using Raspberry Pi Imager. Then, enable SSH by creating a text file named SSH. Next, connect the Raspberry Pi to your router. To find the IP address of Raspberry Pi you use the free advanced IP scanner software. Next, you use SSH to install and configure FreeRadius on Raspberry Pi. You should set a static IP address for Raspberry Pi. Follow the steps below. Next, install FreeRadius, apt-get install FreeRadius. In order to whitelist our TP-Link wireless router we will open the clients.conf file and add the client as above. Once the AP has been whitelisted we need to add users allowed to authenticate. To do this, I take a few steps. Now that configuration is complete we can start the free radius service. 
FreeRadius has the functionality to test the newly created username and password by running the following command. In order to tie in FreeRadius to the TP-Link wireless router I will need to log into my router. You need to go to WPA2 Enterprise and enter the following information, IP address of Raspberry Pi, secret code. The wireless device should prompt you for both a username and password. Now you are done setting up Wi-Fi authentication using the username and password using FreeRadius. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.